Driving through Lakeview today, the homes are in ruins. Where water once stood, a line marks the spot where it came to a stop. Too late to save these homes. The area is a ghost town. Oh, my crystal's in there. Except for a few families like the Nessers who came to salvage what they could. And after seeing the destruction, they're not worried about Rita. At this point, I don't have anything else to lose. So, no, that's why I'm here today getting what I can out, and that's it. Okay, wait. Oh, that's the dresser? No, that's the chest drawers. That's the dresser. Let's see if we can. What they can get out, they will. Just mementos from a time before Katrina. Memories they will treasure idea. forever. From the American Legion, they gave me that for daddy. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I have all of their pictures from the time when she graduated from high school, the college graduations, and all that all along the walls of my house. And it's like, maybe I can save one of them. Just blocks away, <coughs> it's the same story. Some special things that belong to my daughter. One in particular that I just love and it made it. And that's the dog Blue up there, and that's her picture. As Nancy Little tries to save all she can from her place, the single mother was renting and didn't have renter's insurance. It's hot, it's moldy, it's disappointing. Little runs the business committee for Lakeview Civic Improvement Association. And even as she tries to save what she can from the organization, she hasn't lost her sense of humor. And I want to introduce you to uh, Donald Trump Noodle. That's Noodlebird, and actually he stayed here through the whole thing. He's lost his, uh, his feathers on top that made him look like Donald Trump, but uh, he'll get better. All messed up, full of mud, you can't get to the property, cars under mud. Theodore Lewis Jr. will get better too, but it will take time. We spoke with the private security guard right after he had viewed his home in Lakeview, and his pain is heartbreaking. Don't even look like people live there. The whole neighborhood just gone. Jennifer Huntley, Channel 4 Eyewitness News.